Shalom and welcome to PowerPoints. I want to shift gears here. I've been ministering. We've been coming in agreement for an awakening. But I want to shift our awakening, particularly in this season, to the one new man and the awakening of the bride of Christ. In, in Exodus 21, in Exodus 21.10, it says, If he takes another wife, he shall not diminish her food, her clothing, and her marriage rights. If he takes another wife. You know, and as I was studying this out, and I was studying the covenant of marriage, because I really feel like this year that is coming, particularly uh, there is going to be a lot of pressure on the covenant that God has with the bride and also on the uh, relationship between Israel and the church. And there's no reason for us to, uh, to fight in the spirit over who's first, who's second, who's better, and who's best. Because the scripture is quite clear here uh, in Exodus that it says when he takes another wife, he's referring to that there's been an issue here and now there's a new wife that has to come. It says don't diminish. And that's kind of how I feel about the, uh, the Gentile church. The Lord came to the Jews first. God put blindness upon Israel, according to Romans 11, and now the church has been grafted in. But we don't need to get in any battles over, he likes us best, he likes this bride. You know, he's coming back for one in Christ, one in Messiah. But it says he's not diminished. So what I want to pray today, and this is an unusual PowerPoint, I pray, Father God, that any division, any splits, or any mixture would be removed out of all of us that are listening, Jews and Gentiles alike, that, Father God, you are returning for one in Messiah. You are returning for the bride of the one new man. And, Lord, I thank you that you are cleansing us from any uh, elitism, any separatism, uh, and, Lord, that you are coming back for us as one. And, Lord, you see us as one, so we are coming back as one. And I'm not doing any, this isn't replacement. This is a heart issue that he is returning for Israel and he is returning for the church and he will gather us together as one, according to the scriptures, as the one new man in Yeshua's name. God bless. I'll see you tomorrow.